Hi everybody, thanks for joining Create with D. Today we're gonna make some flower treats. It's They are so perfect, perfect, perfect for Easter, springtime, and summer get-togethers. They're made with using the springtime foil-wrapped Rolos and Reese's Peanut Butter Cup wrappers. Um, you could so do just the normal ones too, but right now the springtime foil wraps are out and it makes it really super cute. So if you um, want to make these throughout the spring and summer, you may want to get some stashes of the Rolos and the Hershey and the Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. So super si simple and easy. What I did was I used the Mixed Bunch stamp set and I used this image here and I stamped a couple of different versions for you. Um, I've got over here on this side, this would be the Brights Collection color tones, and over here is more of the pastels, and which would be the Subtle Collection, so that you can kind of see the, the color variations. On um, some of these, I stamped it on Whisper White, and then punched out, and on others I stamped tone on tone, like here's the Melon Mambo, and um, you know, to get the real solid look on cardstock. So again, I did one with, um, I stamped it on Whisper White, and then I used the coordinating cardstock of the ink for it. And so, you know, to do this um, stamp and this punch, it's really easy. Go ahead and stamp your image first, and then with the Blossom Punch, We'll simply line up our image. Whoops, I stamped it in that orientation. We'll get that lined up and punch. Again, I love the coordinating um, stamp sets that have, or have the stamp sets that have the coordinating punches. Just makes for such neat options with your stamp set. And punch that. Okay, so that's all there is to do with the basic um, flower part of it. Then what I did for the Rolos, I used the three-quarter circle punch. And I came in here and it goes right into the center and we want to you know, just pop out that center and then we can take our Rolo and it fits right into it. Let me go ahead and use this one. It's a little more contrasty. I meant to grab the contrasty pink color rather than, you know, to what goes with the foil wrap so that you can see it better. There we go. And it just kind of tucks into that. And really that's all it is. So on the ones that I punch out and made the center, what I did is I took a scallop punch. Oh goodness, this is the small scallop. I'll have the size up here on the, on the video. Took the scallop punch and that's going to be a little base to it. Okay, so those are that's the three things that we need to make these. Little mini glue dots to keep things put down. Just take the candy wrapper and pick up the glue dot. You probably do not want to use liquid glue because you wouldn't want to inadvertently get any of the um, the glue, you know, into the into the chocolate. And then that goes on top. How cute and simple. Oh my gosh. And then um, if you don't want to do the punch out, what you can do is, again, you know, just use the tone on tone with the card stock. And now in this case, you know, I've already got a couple of mini glue dots on that. So if you don't want to do the punch out, just put your candy treat on top. So that's it. That's as simple as it, as it gets. And if you wanted to, you could add some leaf to it. Here I took the Build a Blossom punch, punched out a leaf, and you know wrote the name on it. So of course these would be little, um, kind of act like a table tent, a little you know welcome treat for your guest as they sit down at your table. And just with the mini glue dot, you know I put the leaf on the back, and then now Lisa knows where her um, where her seat is. So these little flowers, so many ideas for them, but you guys, I can so see and be for ladies' teas that are coming up here in the spring and May. Um, just such a cute little thing. Put them on, surprise your coworkers with a little treat when they walk into work. Just whatever. Just so super sweet. So I hope you enjoy making your little Rolo and Reese's miniature um, cup 
flower treats using the Mixed Bunch stamp set and the Blossom Punch. Thanks for watching everybody. Happy crafting. Bye-bye.